Hello everybody! Today is another unboxing and I'm doing the second attempt to successfully receive uh, the HDS HIM diagnostic tool for Honda. Uh, a little bit about this box. As you can see it was delivered by DHL today. It was shipped on November 2nd, so it, today is November 6th. Uh, so, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, 6th, 5 days. It took 5 days for this package to get from Singapore to Delaware, United States. Uh, inside this box there should be, uh, as I mentioned above, I mean earlier, uh, diagnostic tool for Honda and I hope it's there I hope this time it's, it's there and everything is fine because my other Honda which is Honda Odyssey failed today just a few hours before this was delivered to me so this package is sealed I have I haven't opened it yet so everything just like when this thing is empty but anyway so this is still sealed and let's open it yellow knife for a yellow box So just regular plastic bag, DHL plastic bag. Now, all right. So this time it seems it's more serious. And by the way, I I ordered this kit from obdii365.com. They have a website. It's not just eBay where guys from China post items for sale. And also they may claim that they have items in United in United States but I did some orders not not this but different orders before and I know that sometimes eBay doesn't even know <coughs> where the item is being shipped from uh, but it's obdii365.com just in case I purchased this thing for 105 including shipping and now I just checked that link it costs 109 so but anyway let's see they included ZTEC RS232 to USB uh, adapter but I hope I won't need it because my laptop should have RS232 port So cables, one cable it looks like ODB, OBD on one end and some weird three pin uh, like network looking but it's bigger than network uh, cable on the other end. Power adapter for US it also, I mean I see you can plug it in anywhere so it, it's AC 100 to 240, so it's universal, it's a great thing. Now again we got some, I, I don't know what is it, like dummies? One is OBD, it's just like this, it, you can't n connect nothing to it. Another one is RS-232, I have no idea why I need these things. Now, uh, it's RS-232 to some Ethernet cable. The box, which seems to be exactly the same like I purchased before. So this is the box. And what was missing now? I see all these things are in some uh, like bubble wrap. Uh, first the back sticker 
3M tape on one side and on the other side it says Hunter Diagnostic System. I mean, whatever. The second sticker is this, again, 3M and Hunter. Hunter Interface Module. HIM. So now I know what stands for HIM. Hunter Interface Module. Uh, and some it's probably a copy it's just regular DVD I hope it contains the software this is the most important thing so again DVD two stickers this box with OBD port and the empty box here So this is it and now I got two problematic Hondas in my garage and I mean my Honda Odyssey just stopped I mean the engine was uh, like doing some weird things just before I parked here in this parking lot where I live just maybe 50-70 meters I'm glad it happened during the day. I'm glad it it didn't occur uh, on like a highway because before I was driving like everywhere. Also, my Honda Accord needs uh, the SRS light to be fixed, and the dealership, my local local dealership, wants a hundred bucks to just to see what's going on and this is it this is 105 and I hope it will help me to see what's going on with my Honda Accord and with my Honda Odyssey so this package looks better because it has it includes DVD I hope it's not empty I mean I hope it's not like blank DVD and two stickers actually stickers uh, nothing. I mean, it's just piece of like paper, like some sort of plastic. But the previous package didn't contain stickers, and it didn't contain this software. Uh, at least I'm glad that I received this thing. Thank you guys from OBDII. 365.com uh, what else can I say nothing the package was shipped from Singapore uh, not China I don't know if they have some stock there in Singapore I guess all this stuff is made in China but uh, somehow they shipped this thing from Singapore uh, and since my laptop has RS232 uh, serial port it's probably like a bonus to me I mean whatever I got I, I know I, I like free stuff so just stay with me in my next videos I will show you how to install this thing on my laptop so but by the way this is the laptop it's Lenovo laptop uh, and this is the base, so it's a bit thick. It's 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 uh, uh, it's not that super old laptop. It's a small laptop, but this is the base, and the base has all kind of ports that you can only imagine. So serial, parallel, and even some USB, some network, and what is missing? It missing CD. And for that reason, I got this from Lenovo. It's uh, ultralight, ultra slim, superior DVD read write. So DB60, I had it for a couple of years already. Used it a few times, maybe to install the operation system, uh, operational system, or like whatever, like Windows, on this laptop.
after I purchased it. So this is it, my laptop and these things. I hope I can I can make them love each other like these guys do. Uh, they are very friendly to each other and I hope that this thing will soon work with all these things. And as soon as I learn why I need these blanks or dummies, I mean, there is a reason why they send it to me. I mean, I have, I don't see any, I mean, I don't have any idea why I need this. But again, stay with me. In my next videos, I will be doing installation. And later I will be doing, I hope I will be doing uh, some troubleshooting diagnostics because my RDC is parked, I started the engine and it starts it starts shaking and turns off. I have no idea. It's 2005 Honda RDC. I mean, it's not new. I don't blame Honda. It's like 12, 12 years old vehicle. I had it for a year and a half, so whatever. Thank you. Stay with me. And I see you in my next video.